everyone, I'm Noreen and welcome to my kitchen. And today we're going to make some delicious Italian style chicken soup. But we're not going to cook it all day and we're not going to use the slow cooker. We're going to use our pressure cooker and we're going to have slow cooked amazing flavor in just about an hour. You are not going to believe how delicious this is. And if you have a pressure cooker, you need to get it down off the shelf. And if you don't have a pressure cooker, I highly suggest that you get yourself one of these electronic versions because... I reach for this so many times during my week, it isn't even funny. So let's go see how I make this delicious Italian-style chicken soup. Go over the ingredients, and as I do, I'm just going to pop them in my pressure cooker vessel. This is super easy. You're gonna have chicken soup in about an hour and it's going to taste like you cooked it all day long. So, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my mirepoix. I've got four stalks of celery, four carrots, and two medium-sized onions and they've all been cut thusly. Um, so I also have about a pound of cremini mushrooms. This is going to give this a really rich flavor. I have about a handful of uh, flat leaf Italian parsley. Um, and I'm taking the juice of one lemon. Okay, so now I have a whole chicken. And I cut this up myself. And I have the breast. Here's the leg and the thigh sections. These have both, all three of these pieces have had the skin removed and a good portion of um, the fat has been trimmed away. The only thing I left the skin on was the, the wings. And the reason I did that is because it's a pain in the butt to get the skin off of the wings. And, uh, and you want a little bit of fat in there. I have a 28 ounce can of petite diced tomatoes. And then I'm going to start seasoning this up a bit. Whoops, I almost forgot. Garlic. This is garlic I prepared myself and put it in a jar. I'm going to do a video on how to do this. So two, three cloves of garlic, whatever is your preference. About a teaspoon of poultry seasoning. This is my homemade poultry seasoning that I do have a video for. And this is my sedged chicken seasoning. I'm going to be liberal with that about two teaspoons to a tablespoon of that. Okay, the only other thing that we're gonna need now, I'm gonna pull, put this in the pressure cooker. And I'm gonna take and fill this to the line, like just here. I'm gonna fill it like to here with water. I have an Elite 10 quart pressure cooker. If you have a different brand, um, please, Consult your manufacturer's um, instruction manual to help you understand the best way to do this process. There we go. And now I'm just going to take um, a long spoon and I am going to give this a stir. This is just me. This is just to get everything mixed up really quick. This is certainly not necessary, but it is nice. Okay, now I'm going to put my lid on. I'm going to make sure that this is in the pressure position. I'm going to select soup and stew. And then I'm going to increase this time to 60 minutes. And we're going to cook our soup. We'll be back when this is ready to serve up a delicious bowl of Italian chicken soup. Our chicken soup has cooked for an hour and come down from pressure. I have actually opened this up and it smells incredible, I have to tell you. It just smells amazing. So now all we're going to do is I have a bowl over here. I am going to remove the chicken. All right. I think I got all the chicken out. But if you didn't, it's not a big deal. Like there's a piece there. I'll just leave it in. It's not a big deal. Now, I like to let the chicken sit off to the side for a moment and then I'll take it off the bone. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some spinach 
in here because I think that will be lovely. And this is just on the warm setting. So I'm just going to let this wilt in. Now we're going to just go and I'm going to let this spinach wilt down and then we're going to come back when this is ready and I'm going to fix you a delicious bowl of Italian style chicken soup. All right, there you have it. A beautiful bowl of that delicious Italian style chicken soup that we made in our pressure cooker in just about an hour. Now, when I was growing up, the only way that I liked my chicken soup was with a sprinkling of freshly grated Parmigiano Reggiano and some grated, some freshly cracked black pepper. Even when I was a kid, Pepe con Parma on my soup. Okay, and then if you need a little extra salt, of course it's on the side. But there you have it. You want to taste it, sweetheart? Sure. Mm. Mm. That is okay. Mm -hmm. And you didn't have to cook it all day long. Mm -hmm. You cooked it in an hour. Okay, so I hope that that satisfies your need. I know a lot of people have told me they got new electronic pressure cookers for Christmas. And could I please do more recipes? I'm going to make it my goal to try and do a pressure cooker recipe at least once every two weeks, if not more often, if I can get to it. So look for more in the pressure cooker. So I hope you try this delicious pressure cooker Italian chicken soup, and I hope you love it. And until next time, I'll see ya. Thank you for joining me in my kitchen today. I hope you liked what you watched today, and I hope that you try it, and I hope that you love it. Uh, if you like what you saw, please consider hitting the thumbs up button and giving me a positive rating. And also, make sure that you hit the subscribe button if you're already not a subscriber so that you don't miss out on any of the fun we have here in our kitchen every single day. I hope that you enjoyed it. I'm really glad that you're here. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to come by tomorrow. Until next time, happy eating!